Hey, what's going on, everybody? Welcome back. Kellen here from Droid Life. So I still got my Galaxy Tab, the uh, Verizon version, and I'm going to whip through some games today just to show you guys, you know, what gaming is like on a device with the screen this big. Okay, so that's one of the draws. I can tell you right now, first weekend with it, that's basically all I've done with it all weekend was play games on it just because it's so addicting on a screen this big. So again, I'll show you comparison to Droid X. So seven inches here on the Tab and 4.3 inches here on the Droid X. So I know a lot of people, I keep seeing in comments and stuff, people comparing these as not being that big of a difference, but look at that right there, seven inches compared to 4.3. I mean, it dwarfs the Droid X. So there's definitely a difference, and when you're playing games, you'll tell right away. So let's load up just a few and show you guys how these work. Actually, I should talk about, first of all, not every game is gonna be full screen, and there's a hack that we've already posted out there. Um, so check us out at Droid Life, and there's a hack that'll get you full screen every single app you're using. So let's just get that straight. So when, when I show you these, every single game I'm playing is gonna be full screen on here. But if yours isn't, just check out Droid Life, and we'll get you hooked up there. So anyway, let's go right in. First thing we should probably show you is uh, Angry Birds, since that's the game everyone is still obsessed with to this day. And what I'm going to do is show it to you on the Droid X as well. Okay, so here we go, Angry Birds. Let's go to the new levels, big setup. Let's go to level two. Pull it up on the Droid X too. Okay, so here we go, here it is. Can't really get you a good view of that. Droid X version, Galaxy Tavern. So you can see how big of a difference that is. Okay. Pretty cool, right? So it's so much more fun on a big device. So anyway, put the Droid X away for now. So here we go. Galaxy Tab, Angry Birds. Um, you can still pinch to zoom, so you can go way out. Um, when you first start playing it, the bird just looks, just looks ginormous. And that was pretty awful. Let's start that over. So when you first start playing it, though, the bird looks ginormous, and your whole aiming sort of off. You've been playing Angry Birds for a while, so we'll try that one more time. There we go, past that level. Okay, so Angry Birds looks pretty sweet on a big giant seven inch screen like this. So those Angry Birds enthusiasts out there, you are definitely going to enjoy this. I will tell you that right now. And I lost that. Okay, so there's Angry Birds. Let's go ahead and uh, let's get out of there. Show you another game real quick. And another one we've been playing, and is one of our favorites, Flick Kick Football. Okay, this is uh, an open fan game. And uh, I'm not actually sure who makes it, but Flick Kick, there's a whole series of them. There's Flick Kick, Field Goal, Rugby. But Football is the newest one, and we featured it. We've got a whole video walkthrough on this already, but this is definitely one of our favorites. Um, so we just go play. And let me pull this up on the Droid X also. Just like to show these comparisons, I just keep hearing that everyone says, well, it's not that much bigger than my Droid X, but it really is a lot bigger. All right, so Flick Kick, though, just because it's set up, I believe, portrait, it doesn't necessarily fill up the whole screen. You can see there's a little spot there, and there's a little spot up top as well. And I do not believe there's a way to get that to go away. That's just the way the game's built. They've done it as big as they can. Otherwise, I think it would look really distorted. Okay, so let me pull it up on Droid X. So you can see how big it is on here, and you can still kick and flick. I had to get used to playing it again because it's so big, you have to do extra long flicks than you normally would. Okay, so here we go again. See the difference there, Droid X versus Galaxy Tab. It's a big difference, people. Okay, anyway, put that aside again. So yeah, flick, kick, it's the same, you know, it's the same game, it's just on a bigger screen. You can get extra lives, you can do all the curves. It just seems a lot more fun to curve balls and do all the little tricks and stuff you can do on it on a bigger screen, okay? Been logging a lot of hours on this this weekend as well. Okay, so that's Flick Kick Football. Let's go ahead and uh, let's just get out of there. Check out another game, Fruit Ninja. This is one of the first games I pulled up when I got this just because Fruit Ninja, even on a Droid X or something like that, it, uh, you know, it seemed sometimes a little tedious when you get the bombs floating in there with fruit and stuff like that. Sometimes it's hard to get all of those, but I'll tell you right now, on this device, you will not have a problem slashing fruit. Actually, let's pause that real quick. Okay, so I got it pulled up on Droid X2. Okay, so again, you can see there's a huge difference there, right? Okay, put the Droid X version away and let's resume. And slash some fruit. Oh, I totally whiffed that. I was looking through the viewfinder, sorry. I'm really not that pathetic at Fruit Ninja. Oh, missed the bomb. Okay, so you can see it's just big. It looks fantastic. The graphics are nice. 
it is able to run these with no problems whatsoever. You know, it just flies through these games that we all love so much. Okay, so let's just retry that one more time, just show you guys a couple more. So there's not a lot of lag, there's nothing weird going on, it's just blazing through this, you know, it's one gigahertz processor in here, it's a Hummingbird Samsung processor, so it's just flying. So uh, yeah, Fruit Ninja, a lot of fun on here, anything on this screen is really a lot of fun. It's just a big, bright, beautiful screen, and all these games that are interactive are just a lot of fun on here. Okay, so anyway, we'll get out of that. The other game I did want to show you was... Well, I'll show you a couple more. I'm going to go ahead and show you Reckless Racing. This is one of those games that will not be full screen unless you apply that hack that you can find at Droid Life. But once you get it full screen, like it doesn't, it doesn't slow down at all. It doesn't glitch. It doesn't look bad. It actually looks even better because it's big and full screened and everything. So let me just show it to you really quick. Same game. The graphics are amazing on this game, actually. Once you get it this big like this, it just looks awesome. So gaming on the Galaxy Tab is definitely a big winner. This is what's totally selling me on thinking about grabbing one of these devices. And of course, as long as we get the uh, confirmation that it will get, you know, gingerbread or something like that, it'll be really awesome. Let me also crank the uh, sound up on this because it has these really nice speakers at the bottom. So... So you can hear the full experience here. So there you go, anyway, let's we'll stop there. Okay, pretty cool, right? So that is uh, Reckless Racing. And then I also want to show you that it does come pre-installed with a couple of Game Loft games. Um, you got Nova down there, and then you have Let's Golf. Both of them are trial versions, so they only give you a couple of levels to play, and then you got to buy them. But uh, you can definitely see how Game Loft games are going to be amazing on tablet devices, including you know the Galaxy Tab. So here, let me just pull up Let's Golf real quick and show this to you. Yeah, Game Loft's done a nice job. It's too bad they won't um, release their games on the Android market so we could all get them easily. I will tell you that I tried to get a couple of Game Loft games to show you guys through GameLoft.com and struggled. It kept giving me errors and all kinds of stuff. I was never actually able to purchase them. I don't know if they're just not compatible with this yet. That could easily have been the issue or what was going on. But anyway, I'll show you Let's Golf real quick. It's a fun little golf game that they give you. I believe it's two holes to play. So let's jump right in. You can see it's big bright beautiful it's uh, actually a pretty nice game just go to instant play let's choose Jack because he's got a cool hat and let's let this load up so like I said all weekend just been playing games on this device um, actually it's sort of taken over when I'm at home I've really just been using this rather than my phone because it's so much bigger and more fun so you can see it does a flyby and uh, it shows you the whole hole, and it doesn't struggle. There's not a lot of lagging or glitching. The graphics look amazing. Overall, it's just pretty sweet. So with this game, basically, it's like any other golf game. You get your power, and then you got to line it up and smack the ball. You can you can spin it. You can do all kinds of stuff. You can choose clubs. You know, it's a pretty decent golf game actually. And now. Spin that bad boy. See that? So pretty sweet. I'm actually gonna. Won't let me putt. Won't let me putt from there. It's sort of weird. Anyway, you guys get the point. So that's Let's Golf this is one of the games um, from Game Loft that actually comes pre-installed on there. I'm not gonna show you Nova, um, but yeah, that's pretty much it. Actually, Skyforce. I will show you, uh, see Skyforce we actually hacked, used the hack to get it to go full screen and it actually won't load up. I don't know if you're noticing that. We have the hack on that's supposed to make everything full screen and for whatever reason Skyforce says, nah, -uh, I do not want to go full screen. So you may run into a couple issues with a couple of games, 
But so far, like Reckless Racing and some of the others I've had no issues with, and they all load up just fine and look amazing on this device. So anyway, Galaxy Tab, we're gonna be covering it, you know, for a couple weeks now, Droid Life, we're gonna have a whole section built out. Here's all the games on them. Um, drop us questions, check us out, peace.